evening. Welcome everybody to the community. Today we are on episode 11 of Power World and we are finally upgrading our base to max. We're going to get three bases in total, start to build a giant mansion made of stone and get a good work area as the two other bases. This of course does mean that we are going to be getting rid of our main base which is very depressing to be honest. We're going to have to say goodbye to the giant mansion in front of us, even though we do love it, because we need a stone one. This one's going to burn down eventually, and there's no doubt about it. We have filled up the resources like no other. While we went AFK for a long period of time, a couple of days. We got 71,000 stones, so we're going to be able to build this stone mansion, no problem. 12,000 wood, we're, we're lacking on that. We got 437 ingots, with more being produced by the second. Also got a ridiculous amount of cloth. Where's that at? A thousand cloth, which is insane because I, I found out that you need high quality cloth. All right, to upgrade the base, we need a weapons assembly line. Go ahead and get that out. We're about to move all this stuff, so I don't really care how it looks. We also managed to upgrade this while offline. <laughs> Cherry rifle. He's supposed to be shooting. I'm not really sure how this works. We kind of skipped all the base levels in our playthrough, which we did not mean to do at all. But it's okay, it's okay. A musket would be nice, I must admit. Alright, upgrading the base, and then what's the last thing we need to get it to max level? Max level is 16. Build improved furnace. Let's see here, I haven't even looked through this much with the vids at all, I've just kind of been doing it quietly as well. Furnace, 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 furnace. I could do this right now. It just depends on what it is. Improve furnace? Oh, we already have that. We have it at our other base. Oh, yeah, we can just go to the other base and level up. Beautiful. Even if he's just hanging out with us today, thank you so much. Alright, yeah, now we level up. What? You can go higher than this hold up max number of pals is limited by world setting let's just fix that right quick 20 for sure why wouldn't you do that yeah if you could put 20 pals in the base i'm going to there's no reason not to all right now we can get some more miners in here everybody's real depressed and weakened on this island but i don't have the meds to fix it and i don't have enough mines to swap them out so we're just gonna have to deal with it for a little bit here Alright, beautiful. Grab these ingots, head back to the main base. Alright, I just need to get the materials for this right here, and then we're gonna go make that new base. Fragments, wood, and stone. The amount of stone I have is insane. A little bit of wood, a little bit of fragments, and we are going. I already got a spot kinda somewhat picked out, honestly. Put the cement back, and I already got to have a spot picked out. The first spot, I'm going to build a castle, okay? That's going to be on the chinchilla, chinchillit spot, where, where this uh, boss is based right here. I do need to get 10 of them before I do it. I've seen a lot of people suggest putting your base over here in the ruins, which is really cool in concept, but it hurts my soul not to make full use out of the circle. And uh, you kind of can't right there. Some of the edges are going to be hitting that wall. If the circle perfectly fit in there, it'd be beautiful. And let me mention this right quick. Why is it not a square? We really just need a square because everything's square in this game. The base should be a square. But anyway, I found this spot right over here. I think it's absolutely beautiful and perfect. The, perfect, the circle will fit perfectly right there. You got the castle, the view, everything. And we're going to build a giant castle right here. That will replace the main base. But that's not what I want to do right now. I need a completely flat area to put in some work spots. So that we can get rid of all that at the base. Just now unlocking three of these bad boys. Go ahead and grab the sweeper right quick. I haven't got to hunt anything in days. I'm itching for it. Yeah, that'll do the trick. Oh yeah, look how many balls we have too. We have all the different balls now. So that'll do it. Yeah, it's still going north. We got one of these already. I wouldn't mind another one to be honest. I don't think there's anything wrong with going through the dungeons a bunch. 
I even read online at this point and it says not to upgrade attack. I kind of think I'm somewhat for it. People debate on not even doing health because of the fact that everything in the late game just one hits you. So like what's it matter in concept? Which I guess I understand that. Honestly, this right here isn't even that bad of a spot for a base. Like, look at this flat area. That's why I wanted to come up here. I thought I remembered a bunch of flat area. Oh, you got the Nightwing boss right there. Boss man, wake up. Can you help a homie out, monkey? Please! You're about to get put off the team so quick, it's ridiculous. We can kill it, it's really no stress. I'm not dying, not dying, not dying, not dying, not dying. It's not worth it. It didn't even kill it, whatever. I got 10 fox parts. I don't know if I have 10 of those dream things. Is that a flat circle? That might be the perfect spot for the base. Or is that water? If it was water, it would make more sense, honestly. Oh yeah, it's water. Oh, it's a boss. Yeah, whatever. I'm not even stressing about it. Oh, there's a checkpoint over there. I have got to be missing so many checkpoints, because they are ridiculously hard to find. Yeah. I got 10 spot sparks. Oh, come on. That mine is not worth that many balls. Balls cost ingots now. What's this over here? Whoa, that's a big area too. There's so many open spots. This is exactly what we needed for a base. Which one do we want? This one has ore in it. All right, clean it up. We're gonna need this area. I just need to figure out where the center is. I'll place one of these things right quick. I want it. I just I want a perfect circle with flat ground so that I could really make some stuff. Right about I think here. Did we bring extra stone? I think we did. Yeah, we got enough. Uh, it's probably just like place this down then then replace okay okay bird you you always do this it's the worst spot to stand get behind me All right, how's this look? That side's definitely good. That side's good. Oh my god, it's a perfect circle on the ground. Beautiful. I don't think we want to move it. I mean, it could totally fit over here, too, though. How's this area look? This is super flat, though. I mean, you can't get a better circle to work with than that. But yeah, devs, uh, make that a square. There's no reason it shouldn't be a square. Everything in my building sector is squares. You got beds, but eh. This one has a hill, which actually causes huge problems in building. I think for sure you got 10 of these. We got 10 of that. 10 of that, 10 of that, 10 of that. 10 of that. 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 I don't know why we don't even know what that is yet. Only one of that. I can get three of them. I need those night minions. As far as like the left and right, I love it. Front to back, yeah. I'm moving it. I ain't got enemy. 
Barry, do you have a serious problem with that? You didn't, you didn't, oh man, pals. The crate, check it out now. Edges looking perfect, front to back is honestly better. Yeah, it's not even that much difference, but it's, it's, it's nice. All right, now I'm putting stone everywhere around here. Everywhere, the whole ground. This here, I think that's gonna be the basis. Oh no, it's way too far. Perfect. When it starts hanging out, that's my whole issue. I'm pretty sure those are okay. I don't know if that one is. Alright, I gotta go get a bunch of stone. But yeah, stone and metal and wood are the only building materials. So, I mean, you might as well do a nice stone base. And then everybody seems to be using this amazing little handy thing. Where you put... We're getting rid of this guy because he's a joke even with a gun. Get one of these dire owls on the team. And supposedly you can walk while overweight. We're gonna check it out. They did fix this, and no matter how overweight you are, you can still move a little bit, which I think is good. This one doesn't know the move I need. I need one that knows a certain move. Or maybe you have to teach it the move. I think it's air cannon. Could be. Actually, it's probably not. It's like a rush attack. Is it Fierce Fang? Oh, it is Fierce Fang. My bad, my bad. Alright, yeah, so now I'm overweight. Slow as mess. But you just use this and get... Oh, yeah, and it charges super instantly. Look at that. Now, that's the future right there. Back to this bad boy. I do feel like I'm hurting the the ground. Storage, a little wooden crate, that's all I need. Just right here. There we go, now we can get around. I, I sat down and thought about this a little bit last night, so I got a general idea of what we're doing here. I'm putting this whole ground to stone, by the way. That's like the main objective right now. Do we have a pickaxe on us? Yeah. I'm gonna have to get rid of some stuff. The spot's perfect. I really don't want to mess this up. I don't think that's too much out of the base. One more, and then this here is what bothers me. Do we seriously need to make it so that the other side goes out enough so that this side's okay? Because that right there, that, that that's going to get destroyed. There's no doubt about it. Nope. I'd have to destroy all these blocks in order to fix this. How just painful. They should make the width of the circle exactly how many blocks so you don't have to do something like this. But we are building, like, our main structure, so I'm cool with doing something a little while. The building mechanics in this game, I think, frustrate everybody, from what I see. Alrighty, yeah, now let's see what you look like if you go all the way this way. Oh. Perfect. Yeah. Yeah. This is why we need a square base, devs. Like, we need it. You don't understand. I could build so much prettier things. Just based on that one shape. I think that's like the most that a block could go out and not be destroyed. And I could be wrong about that. 
Alright, I'm going back to the house to sleep right quick. Alright, now from what I remember, it was right there, but I could be so wrong. Alright, check the edges. Should have did that before I got too deep in. Looks good. Looks great, actually. That one's pretty far out there, but it, it still lasts. These are the ones I'm worried about, honestly. I think I moved it even farther, which is okay. We're just going to get rid of the outside ones. Oh, we need wood. I could grab some. Can you please let me get on my mount right there? Or just keep watering the dang plants. <laughs> Fabulous. Best way to travel while overweight. This really is fast. Faster than the grappling gun. I don't even have the grappling gun. After finding the flattest base location in Pal World, we are ready to build our giant castle next episode. But I'm still asking myself, are there even guns in this game? Tune in next time for episode 12 of Pal World with Rilovich. But yeah, just let me know, i give you the code. The code changes every single time, and you have to get a new code every single time.